It's it's already got a hold of the string from the previous tie. I can't hear yes. And when the needle brings up the other piece, you'll have both ends of the string in here. That twists around to pull the ends through, and that that's what makes the knot. Yeah. And these were one of the strangest things to I mean the one way? Keep going no in the direction of the arrow. Keep going that way. No, other way. Other way? There you go. You'll have to keep going until the needle comes up. What are you doing this time? I uh is it shushing? Uh something's not stop. Hey Sam, how do we trigger it? <laughs> oh. Did this guy answer your question? I forgot about that part. <laughs> now the needle will come up. Oh, keep going this way. Keep, keep going. this way? Keep going. Yep. Keep going. Are you keep going? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's perfect. Yeah, it's perfect. I was wondering. I was so close to it, I wasn't seeing it. <laughs> See, now that you can see that uh, piece inside there has a hole to both ends and it's going to twist around to make the knot. Yes, Mike? Right. I'm going to pull it through and it's done. Clever. Do you have a new stuff? Yes. Good job. That works. How did, how did you say that? What's that for? It's for a bale. It's a knot around a bale. It's a knot around a bale. That's what that... Well, that pulls the hay through or something. Yeah, not just a bale. So now, so, so now to, to redo the demo... But this is just a demo. To redo the yeah. demo, yeah. This is how the real one works inside. It pulls the string through, sends it through that piece, brings the yarn back through, and they're not and as as the bale gets punched in, right. it pulls out the string, and then at the end, that comes up, does not make the bale. Got it.